सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई शो यू हाउ टू एक्टिवेट मैंटिस माउस प्रो एज यू नो मैंटिस माउस प्रो इज अ गुड अल्टरनेटिव ऑफ पांडा माउस प्रो बाय विच यू कैन प्ले योर मोबाइल गेम्स लाइक फ्री फायर पबजी मोबाइल कॉल ऑफ ड्यूटी विथ की बोर्ड एंड माउस इन योर मोबाइल इट सेल्फ सो विदाउट एनी डिले लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग दिस एक्टिवेशन प्रोसेस लेट मी टेल यू दैट दिस एक्टिवेशन प्रोसेस इज ओनली फॉर एंड्रॉयड एलेवन एंड्रॉयड ट्वेल्व एंड हायर सो इफ यू हैव एंड्रॉयड टेन नाइन और बिलो वर्जन देन यू हैव टू यूज इधर पी सी और अदर मोबाइल टू एक्टिवेट योर मैंटिस माउस प्रो सो आई विल ऑल्सो मेक द वीडियोज फॉर दैट एक्टिवेशन ट्रिक ऑल्सो सो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल इन ऑर्डर टू गेट द नोटिफिकेशन सो लेट्स जम्प इन टू द एक्टिवेशन प्रोसेस So first of all you need to enable developer option to enable developer option you have to go to the settings then go to the about phone then search for the build number you can see here is my build number so this could be in different place in your mobile so you just have to search for it then you have to click seven time after clicking seven time your developer option will be enabled then you have to go back to the application then you have to click tab to start mantis buddy now you can see all the options here so now you just have to follow all the steps so first of all you have to enable floating widgets so click on the enable button now search for mantis mouse pro app now click on it and allow display or other apps now go back to the mantis mouse pro app again now you have to enable usb debugging and wireless debugging from your developer options so just click on enable button now go down and search for usb debugging settings Here you can see USB debugging so you just need to enable this setting now if this kind of security pop up comes up you just need to click i am aware and then okay so now if you have miui in your phone you have to enable one more setting named USB debugging security settings so that needs to be enabled otherwise your keyboard and mouse will not work in your game so in order to enable this usb debugging security setting you have to first log in to your mi account then you will be only able to enable this setting After that you have to enable wireless debugging setting so just click on the wireless debugging now before enabling this wireless debugging setting your phone must have connected with a wifi otherwise you will not be able to enable this wireless debugging setting so here you can see my phone is connected with a wifi so now i will be able to enable this setting so just enable this setting now go back to the app now here one more setting allow screen overlay on the setting you have to enable that so just click on enable button now go down and search for that setting so here is the setting you have to just enable it then go back to the app and press mark as done now this setting we have already enabled so you again have to just click on mark as done now you are all set to pair your mobile with wireless debugging so just click on the start pairing so here one wireless pairing pop up will come so now you have to click on wireless debugging setting and here you have to choose pair device with pairing code option so just click on the pair device with pairing code option so here you can see pairing code is generated like my pairing code is 185428 and here you can see port number like my port number is 41443 as you can see so these two numbers you have to put on wireless pairing pop up so in first input you have to put pairing code and second input you have to put port number So let me put all the numbers quickly. Now you have to click on pair button. Now you have to just wait for some time. So now here you can see ADB pairing is successful and on the top you can see wireless debugging is connected. So if you are stuck in this stage, so as mentioned you have to just close this pop up and go to your app again and then click on the start pairing again. Then you will get another pop up then just put these number again. and then you will be able to successfully pair your device and after a moment you can see mantis buddy is connected now just close this pop up and go to your app again and you can see your mantis buddy is connected so now you are all set to plug in your keyboard and mouse to your phone so after connecting keyboard and mouse you can see it is showing in mantis mouse pro app so now you just have to open your game so let me open pubg mobile here So here you can see Mantis Mouse Pro widget on the top of your PUBG mobile game. So if you click on it, you will find some of the settings. So by default you will not get any key mapping for any of the games. You have to create your own custom key mappings. So let me add some of the key mapping for this PUBG mobile game. So here I have added some of the key mapping to show you how it is working. So here you can see it is working perfectly fine. My keyboard is also working. my mouse is also working 
so that's all for this video so please like my video and if you have any doubts please write down on comments and if you want such kind of contents in future so please subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the latest notification first so this is vivek signing off bye bye